My son said that this humiliation will be returned by 1,000 to those damned ones. In the meantime, let them enjoy their momentary peace. After a while, it will not be so. Time would pass. More than 1,000 years would have passed in that room. Even though so many years would have passed, Goku and Gohan were still alive. Their bodies would not have changed absolutely nothing. The only thing that would change would be their mentality and their strength. When the time chamber was destroyed by the gods of destruction, somehow Goku and Gohan were still alive. The dimension of that room was still preserved, perhaps the work of some strange force. The only thing that can be known is that time is paralyzed in that place. Therefore, their bodies do not age, and they do not feel any kind of hunger. Goku, the first a hundred years, managed to control the mastered Ultra Instinct to a hundred percent. After a few more years, he would achieve a new transformation. This was the Super Saiyan 3 Ascended. Goku would teach his son Gohan how to obtain the transformation of the mastered Ultra Instinct. After Gohan managed to master the mastered Ultra Instinct to perfection, another 100 years would have passed. The two Saiyans would be on par with each other in terms of power. If it wasn't for you, father, I would never have obtained this great power, since you gave me your knowledge to become a god. One question, father. Do you think this is our limit? Gohan, we Saiyans have no limits to our strength. I'm sure that after this transformation, a more powerful one will follow. How can you be so sure of that, father? I don't know. I'm just guessing. We should try something. I want you to fight me with all your power. If you say so, father, I will. Gohan would transform into Super Saiyan 3 Ascended. Goku would also do the same. The two Saiyans would begin to have an extremely fast and brutal fight. A mortal or inexperienced god would not be able to see this great battle. Suddenly, Gohan would throw a powerful blow to Goku in the face that would make him retreat too much. Goku would have drawn some blood from his mouth, but he would wipe it off. Your brute strength is not bad, son. But how about your inner strength? Goku would use his new ability, Eternal Divine Prison. A prison full of divine key would have fallen on Gohan. In these 221 years apart from making me stronger, I have also experienced new techniques that could help me in the future. For example this, Eternal Divine Prison not only restricts the divine power, but also absorbs it. Gohan's divine key would begin to be absorbed by the strange ability of his father. What does this mean, father? Because you locked me in this. Son, don't you want to become stronger? Get out of my eternal prison. A great part of Gohan's power would have been absorbed by this prison. Goku would use mental power to make the gravity of the place increase 10,000 times more. The room would become completely red. I can't feel my body. My breathing is stopped. Perhaps my father has betrayed me after all this time. Father, take me out of this place. M my body can't take it anymore. Gohan would start to scream because of the pain, thus seeing flashbacks of his past before he was locked up. Gohan, forgive me. The only way to know if we can have a new transformation is with you. You are the only Saiyan I know who can increase his fighting level so fast. Maybe in the future you will hate me, but I hope you understand that. Gohan's divine power would have been reduced to zero, thus returning to his base state. Gohan's eyes would turn white while he had an illusion of his daughter and wife being happy in a place outside of that room. What's wrong? Did I leave the room? Fidel, I'm glad you guys are okay. Apparently, Gohan had fallen into a mental illusion because he had run out of divine key. Several minutes passed and Gohan was still in that momentary illusion. Goku wondered many things. Maybe I was wrong about my son. He couldn't get out of the eternal prison. Meanwhile, Gohan continued living his life happily, when suddenly several gods of destruction appeared, killing his daughter and his wife. This can't be true. It can't be that this is happening to me. 
Gohan inside the illusion would begin to release a great power. Many rays would fall inside his body. The illusion would be completely broken. Goku would be able to remove his ability, when suddenly a part of the dimension would begin to tremor. Gohan would let out a loud scream saying, Damn gods, I will make them suffer for the death of my family. Gohan's eyes would have turned a shade of red, while a purple key would fall on him. The eternal prison was breaking little by little. What about my son? He's expelling immense power. I wasn't wrong about him. I'd better get out of here quickly. Goku's eternal prison would break completely. Gohan's blue hair would have changed to a shade of purple. His eyes would change to a shade of red. Apparently, Gohan would have obtained the Super Saiyan Purple God. Gohan's key veins were throbbing strongly. Gohan, who was full of anger, would have lost consciousness, thus starting to attack Goku. Even though Goku was far away, it wouldn't take long Gohan to get close, thus starting to hit him over and over again. Goku would start screaming from the pain, thus telling his son to calm down, but Gohan wouldn't react, thus grabbing Goku by the neck. Goku would throw several energy balls in his face, but they had no effect against the Saiyan. My son's body became so resistant. If I don't escape from his hands, I fear I will lose my life for my own son. Goku's ki would start to glow strongly, leaving Gohan blind for a few seconds. Gohan would let go of Goku and squeeze his eyes. After five seconds, Gohan's sight would have returned to normal. The only thing Goku could do was to use his speed to escape from his son, since no skill or strange technique he possessed at that moment would be useful to him. From Gohan's hand would have come out a small key sphere. This key sphere contained a great level of energy. Goku felt that if this energy ball hit him, it could end his life. The energy ball would be thrown against the Saiyan, but when he was about to be hit, the energy ball would have disappeared. Some red rays would have started to come out of Gohan's body. He would start touching his head while he started to fly senselessly. Gohan's power would start to go down more and more. Apparently, his body was not ready for that transformation yet. His body would return to its base state and then he would faint. This time, I was saved by miracle. My son could not control that transformation. Maybe it will take him a few more years. But the only thing I know is that if I get that transformation, I will also have a fearsome power. The 1000 years would have passed. Goku and Gohan after 1000 years would have finally managed to control this transformation to perfection. I can't believe that we've been in this place for a thousand years. After so long we finally managed to master the transformation of the Super Saiyan Purple God. I don't remember what it was like out there. I, I haven't seen the sunlight in a long time and my memories are still blurry. I feel like I'm forgetting the people that I really care about. Son, I also feel the same way. But the only thing that has kept me going all these years is the hatred I feel for those gods. Besides, we also need to find the culprit that made us stay in this place for so long. Because naturally this is impossible. The world of the strong hides many secrets. Son, are you ready to finally leave this horrible place? Yes father, I'm ready. Goku and Gohan would use the Super Saiyan Purple God, thus increasing all their power. The time chamber would start to shake uncontrollably. At first it seemed that nothing was happening, when suddenly the dimension of the time chamber began to break down little by little. Suddenly, a portal would have been created. Father, look at that! We're finally succeeding in destroying this horrible place! Listen to me, Gohan. When I count three, we will jump into that portal and we will finally be free. I ask that when we go out, you return to your base state. One, two, and three! Goku and Gohan, after increasing their powers, would have jumped into the portal. After the two of them crossed the portal, it would have closed, thus taking them to Universe 6. These two Saiyans were in outer space, to then cover their body with a thin layer of ki to be able to breathe. 
Father, we have finally succeeded. Goku and Gohan would be in their base state. No god or angel would feel any strange anomaly in the universe. Son, I think it is time for revenge. First, we will go to visit the god of Universe 6. Goku and Gohan would have flown at great speed to the planet of Champa, arriving in just minutes. A crater would have been created on the ground of that planet. Champa, who was resting, would have felt that little tremor. So he asked his angel Vados to go and see what was happening. Vados, if it is Kaba or some of those, tell them that I don't feel like talking right now. I am very tired. As you say, Mr. Champa, Vados would have gone out of Champa's room to go outside. The outside was full of smoke. I don't know who you are, but Mr. Kampa doesn't want to see them today, so I suggest them to leave. Goku would start laughing. <laughs> We're not leaving here. We've been waiting for this day for a long time. Goku and Gohan would have come out of the smoke. Vados would be very surprised to see them. Isn't he the Saiyan of Universe 7? How the hell is he alive? And his son seems to be alive too. I saw how that place was destroyed by the gods. They should not exist anymore. Vados would clench his fist tightly. I'm sorry, but I can't move from here. My rules as an angel are to protect my god if necessary. Although I believe that you're not a threat, you're only a hindrance. How can you be so sure of that? Son, just watch me. I myself will finish this with this angel who doesn't know his place. Goku would have transformed into the purple Super Saiyan God, even though Goku's energy was so strong. At that moment, it would have not be felt anywhere since Goku knew how to hide it very well. You think that because your hair changed color, I will be afraid of you? Vados would throw himself against Goku. The angel would hit Goku in the neck. You better go to sleep until soon. The big punch would hit Goku's neck, but Goku would go on like nothing. What's the matter? Normally he would have fall to the ground, because my punch didn't do anything to him. That's all you got, Angel? I just felt tickled. Goku would kick Vados in the face. The Angel would barely be able to dodge that kick. Why did I have such a hard time dodging that? What the hell has he become? 